guys, we're going to, oh, man, I, I kind of feel a little exhausted by this. Like, I almost don't want to do it. Which part? Uh, the Elisa Jordana. You can skip it if you want. Just keep doing fun stories. IRL streaming thing. Uh, yeah, but, you know, why do I podcast sent me these? And he was nice enough to put these together for us. And some of them are, like, legitimately dog shit. Uh, oh, God, this one's embarrassing. Okay, I'm ready again. Okay. I'm going to do this one last, though. I'm going to move this one off to the end. Uh, Elisa Jordana, as you know, she has a Discord that is rife with doxers and rape threats and swatters. ruining people's lives, swatters, things like that. I mean, just an absolutely, I, I don't use this term very often, but an absolutely toxic environment. It's a cesspool. Which is odd because she's always saying like, I just want positivity. I want positivity. That's her whole thing. Well, we called her out for it. We did a couple of videos exposing exactly what goes on in that community, exactly what she does about it, which is fuck all. And then Misery Loves Company confronted her about it, and she looked like a complete dipshit. Just a total bubblehead and a bit of a sociopath. Oh, for sure. As yep. well. Uh, and a, a bratty, bitchy little narcissist. Also, the thing I find funny about Elisa Jordana is she lies about her age. She's humiliated and embarrassed about her age. I got bad news for you, sweetheart. You better come to grips with that pretty soon because that doesn't get better as time oh, yeah, goes on. yeah, it catches up. Embrace the fact that you're in your 40s. Stop prancing around. Like, IRL streaming is the end of the line creatively. IRL streaming is people who just want to be famous. They don't want to be broadcasters. They don't want to have a show. They just, they want to be famous. They don't want to work. They just want to bang on the drum all day and then film themselves on the drum dancing like an asshole. Well, she used to do a podcast. Then we started hammering the shit out of her and she out of nowhere quit her podcast. Yep, nothing to do with us though. Took a couple of little thing segments from Steel Toe calling out what her bullshit uh, community was and then she totally quit doing her podcast. MLC trashed her. She, did, uh, she didn't just postpone her podcast. She said, I'm not a podcaster anymore. So we got her to postpone her podcast. And then Kevin and Bob killed it. And she said, for the, she put out a tweet. I'm not a podcaster anymore. I'm an IRL streamer. We, IRL, we made her change her whole identity. <laughs> we made her change her whole identity. And this what? is the end of the road for her. And I mean, it was, uh, how easy could this have been for her to just say, hey, Right. Knock it the fuck off. That that's was it. That all, was absolutely it. All she had to do. So then with uh, is Elisa Jordana, she's now doing IRL streaming, which is basically you go walk around and you bother the fuck out of people and you film it and people can give you donations and uh, they, they put it on a speaker and people can say whatever they want. Uh, this is a few of these. This is Elisa Jordana, and I swear to God, she has tricked herself into thinking she's a college girl in her 20s. But that's why she lies about her age. It's so embarrassing, because remember, this is a 40-some-odd-year-old woman. She's like the Taylor Lorenz of the streaming world. Yes. Lies about her age, total narcissist, total sociopath. So she goes on here, she films herself. Uh, she criticizes us and MLC for saying, you guys just don't have these problems I have because you're a small channel. Bitch, we both have bigger audiences than you. So that stop. stuff is too easily discredited. Never right. go with that as your argument. So she does her IRL streaming, and it's just a series of people annoyed by her, not entertained by her, or she just finds really damaged people in Los Angeles and uses them for content. She's a pig of a human being. So here's her at like an outdoor mall, and the security is like, who is this old grandma looking bitch? trying to be a college kid. Hey, why, why? I think if you're just recording, making a quick video, but this is a public courtyard, you're making a lot of noise. I make a lot of noise? <laughs> so she's dancing and doing all this shit, and then this guy goes, look, if you were just recording, whatever, but you're f fucking annoying. You're being obnoxious. Yeah. And you're bothering people. Right. Yes, ma'am. Okay, do you have any advice where I could do this? Act your age. That would be my advice. Go, Did you know, maybe get a job at like... I don't know. What's like an older woman's clothing store? Lane Bryant. That's fat girls. That's CJ fat women. Banks. CJ, there you go. That's perfect, April. I think Elisa Jordana should get herself a job at CJ Banks 
and she would do very well there. Or one of those home she decor. She could work at J.C. Penney's. J.C. Penney, Coles. <laughs> she would be great, great at a Coles. I think Elisa Jordana should get a job sampling perfume for people at a Coles. There you go. Department store. What size do you need that counter. shoe in? Exactly. <laughs> that would be perfect for her. Yeah. This man is younger than you, hmm. and he's telling you to grow up. Wow, is she really going there with you right now? Do you have any advice? Because I, I want to do this so bad. I have this blog, and right now I have 300 people watching. Maybe we should just go. Oh, ho, ho, ho. look out for big dick over here. Dude, even he's exhausted yeah, with her. He's he doesn't exhausted. even want to talk to her. And then the people around her are like, thank you. First of all, they're thanking the security guard. And they're like, you're going to listen to the way she's talking? I don't want to go shopping and, you know, run across this. Do you have any advice for me? Like, again, the 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 stereotypical self-centered broad who's just going, oh, I know that you're doing your job and I'm being very rude and taking up a big chunk of your day, but do you have anything for me? Is there anything you could do for me? Like she's going to tell him how many people she has watching her IRL stream and he's going to go, oh, shoot. Well, uh, oh boy, I better stop behaving this but way. I better watch out for you. Ugh. My vehicle? I don't even have a vehicle. Uh-oh. Most Oh, you hear? She said, "Uh oh," because that's the ding is the um, the donation thing, and you can say whatever you want. I want to oh. see if anyone in the chat how much they know about IRL streaming. Why did she say "Uh oh" when she heard that ding? April, do you know much about IRL streaming? No, I don't watch any. Okay, of it. guys, why did she say "Uh oh"? It has to do with who the security guard is. Oh, is there a racist comment coming that could be read out loud? A lot of times when you hear that ding, people write in and the talk to, to donation or the talk to text to speech thing mm -hmm. is going like a lot of people will just write the N word over it. and over sure. and over again. So she's exactly. used to that, I'm sure. So she's like, uh, so I love that. I want to play that again. That uh oh, as soon as she hears the ding. I don't even have a vehicle. Uh oh. <laughs> So she's basically <laughs> expecting the N-word. She is subservient to these pay pigs. And the only reason they give her money is because it gets to read their message aloud. Most at five dollars love you. Okay, not right here. Good okay, thank you. Keep dancing. Okay, okay, we gotta just... just... Oh, this is my song! Thank you, Mouse! Oh, we gotta... Here, I gotta mute it for the... I don't want to play, like copywritten music on the thing and all that. Any... So she has this fucking guy here. The security guard wants her to get the fuck out. She's playing loud music and now she's going to start singing. And the guy's like, excuse me, get the fuck out of here. Time, time. I can't even think of... Oh, my purse, my purse. Can you give me my purse, please? No? Okay. She's... Uh, no. Any... And the secu yeah, she goes to the security guard. Oh, my God, my purse. Can you get my purse? And he goes, No. Any level of hot she is is completely washed away by this personality. No, she's 40, and she's singing into a a, a JBL karaoke mic. Echoey fucking Oh, shit. she is. This is desperation. Like, I hate her, don't get me wrong, and she is a user and a piece of shit, but this is also sad. This is sad. I can't imagine doing this. Imagine wanting to be so famous. If I... And instead of working at it and developing a skill, you just keep bouncing from gimmick to gimmick until you find something that sticks. Elisa, people only put up with IRL streamer shit because they're young and hot. You are neither of those things. Therefore, this is people are just going to act... This security guard may not be as curt with a 22-year-old college mm -hmm. chick with big tits. Um, but he's not impressed by you, so he's going, get the fuck out. Hurry up. Look, I've had to learn a lot in these last few years here. Uh, but if this wasn't working out, I would never be caught dead doing this at right. my age even. Like I said, if this doesn't Not work, close. like if this doesn't work, I'm going to the car lot. You know, yeah, I'm doing something I, like that. I go back to something physical like I'm good at. I don't know. The inter if the internet rejects me, like it's rejected her, I would take a hint and go, I'm not good enough i'm not talented enough right she's been told she's not good enough she's not talented enough by howard stern by youtube by everything everyone has told her she sucks she she's, and she won't give it up she's like queen of denying reality yes Oh, I'm at, like you're in your 40s and you're singing this song like you're at a fucking sorority party. I hate that this guy can't just have somebody like come, you know. I feel bad for this Kick her kid. out of here. He's just trying to do his job.
And she's sitting there bothering him. Oh, stop trying to look hot. You're a public disturbance at this point. I won't even, I'll give her that. I actually think she's a decent looking person. I don't like her at all. Can't give her that. She's She's so ugly on the inside. I can't see any hotness in this woman. She is nasty. And look at this. She's trying to film this guy. She's trying to keep him in frame. And there's a part of me that thinks that she's trying to keep him in frame so the losers and the scumbags in her audience will find out who that is. Yeah, There's, based on what she's done, ba- that, I wouldn't put that past She her. is such a wink and a nod, knowing what her audience is, knowing what they do. She is such a wink and a nod, like, do my dirty work for me, minions. But, you know what to do. And then when people call her out on it, she goes, well, they did the onion about positivity. Right. You're Lying right. Bitch. She winks at these people like, you know what to do. But right. then she can go back later and say, I never told them. I never encouraged Again, them. Again, a cult leader. A cult yeah. leader in everything but name. Still, okay, I don't want to play the copywritten music. So this guy is trying to get the... Fu- He's texting someone like, we're going to get this bitch out of here because she's being a disturbance. She's a public nuisance. And she's trying to film this guy. Look at that. She keeps just, filming. Oh, God. Uh, LA is such a fucking shithole. It is. I. God damn it. I don't understand people that are left there anymore you know like it's kind of like minneapolis at its worst i'm like you got to get out vapid irl streaming twats that's who's still there all right is the music still going Uh, yeah and she's singing oh god this is embarrassing she belongs there with the scum of the earth that's true people filming the homeless and all that shit too yeah i mean she belongs she's in her perfect environment she Uh. really does think she's hot shit she does, and she's just walking by thinking she's entertaining these people. They're just like, no. would you shut the fuck up? Every- so people the get annoyed still- of these people. Even like street performers in Vegas, like people will walk by and like, don't look at me. She really is. She is like one of those bums in Vegas who's like j- like trying to play like a broken tambourine. And they're mm-hmm. like, would you just- They have a five-gallon pail flipped over as a drum. You are you know? ruining my vacation. Please leave me alone. Yes, you're not part oh, of it. Oh, 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 oh. Anonymous sent three dollars. Again, the- she's with a crazy guy. She's using another weird crazy guy to in- enhance whatever the hell she's doing because she has nothing to say, nothing to talk about, nothing to provide. So she brings some crazy guy on there and make him think that he has a shot. So please don't <laughs> scream with <laughs> SJC. He has been badmouthing you, saying you are stalking him. Elisa, please don't stream with SJC. He has been bad-mouthing you and says you are stalking him. Okay, I am not stalking SJC. What happened was, SJC... What, what happened was... Uh, Imagine you're in your 40s and you have to talk this way. She always has an explanation for everything. Oh, you notice that? Always. Anytime some, and it's obviously not us. Anytime somebody calls her out on something, she, no, this is how it was. Right. You don't I'll understand. Tell you, I'll tell you what happened. It's not stalking. So he showed up on my, my show, my podcast, he and he was good on it. And I said, great. And I, I was excited. And then all these people started telling me all these bad things about him. But they do that with a lot of people. On it. Again, she doesn't vet any of these fucking people. She uses them for clout. And then when they start to reveal themselves as to who they are, it's like, what? It's not my fault. The more we see of her videos, it's like it looks like a lot of people try to approach her about how bad the people she surrounds right. herself with are. And then she explains she, it away. She does. She explains everything away. Like this guy right here, I wouldn't put him on anything I do. Why? Because he looks like he could potentially be a problem. Whether his fault or brain chemistry or whatever, I wouldn't include him. But it doesn't him. matter. You just don't, you right. don't want the problem. I wouldn't include him in my thing because it looks like it could be an issue. Her, she thinks three seconds ahead. That's it. Three seconds ahead, and that's all. And, and um, then the rest will figure itself out. The universe will provide positivity, positivity, positivity. You can't surround yourself with negativity and then say you just want positivity. And then is that her real voice, or is she doing a thing? Oh, you hope she's doing a thing. But I think her voice matches her inner character. Just a, an obnoxious, she, shallow valley girl. Yeah, that's that's it. So I don't really listen to everybody. I just listen to like my experience. So I had a good experience with that. That's really smart. You know what you should do is you should disregard all the information and education that you could possibly be getting by, you know, looking into shit and just go by whatever your own brain is telling you because it's led you to uh, filming yourself around piss stained homeless people for a living. Yeah, let's use this as an example. Somebody somewhere 
once upon a time had a good experience with Hitler does not mean he was a good <laughs> uh -oh, guy. Uh-oh, April's doing Kanye. Oh, no, <laughs> I, you said he's a bad guy. No, oh, I okay. said does not mean he was a good guy. Yeah. But everybody else hates him, so they say, is that true? I would stream with him. You wouldn't stream with him? I stream with him. See, like, even her people are like, I wouldn't do that. Well, here's why I'm okay and I didn't do anything wrong. SJC went to jail for beating up his mother's <coughs> boyfriend and spitting on his mother. He also physically... Chad Zumok? Assaulted Gucci. I knew that. So I knew that because uh, Gucci's and SJC were both in my Discord server. Oh, that wow, fucking... Wow, so fucking surprise, surprise. I bet you Botter's probably got their information by now, but you like him. He's great. He's awesome, right? God, I hate it. She the can't stop. She just cannot stop doing it. No, this. she wants to be famous. She's not talented enough. She's on the wrong side of 40, and she just will not stop, even though the universe... You know, she always... You know, she listens to the universe and all this other stuff, but it's telling her, you fucking suck. Go do something productive. Zero Dark Tony with 999 says, for April's Elisa impression. You want to do it again? Oh, my God. I'm just... I'm so okay with all these people. I like them. I don't stand with steel toe or anything. I love Botter. Um, you I know think what he's I, just the salt of the earth. You know what I've heard, and though? positivity. You know what I've heard? Everybody's a buzz about um, the toe guy. Yes. Why do I podcast with 10? Thank you, Kevin Dumbfuck. He says, Steel Toe After Show with uh, Why Do I Podcast? Oh. Check it out. More Elisa Jordana and Perry Caravello. Uh, yes, guys, uh, subscribe to Why Do I Podcast. He'll go on after our show's over, and he does a good show over he there. He does. And it's getting better. Uh, Citizen M says, April, stop it. You're making me aroused. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> uh, fucking guy. <laughs> so, you know, you can say what you want about Andy Dick. Uh. And that Andy Dick is, uh, you know, he's got all these problems and, you know, he's he's let a, he's fucked up his life quite a bit. You could say that. But boy, is he still a good judge of character. You know how I said that pretty soon Elisa Jordana will be doing streams from an RV? Well, I have to apologize for saying that because I didn't know she's already gone down to RV level. Not only that, streaming with Andy Dick inside the RV. And you can tell mm -hmm. that even though they're keeping Andy boozed up and they're keeping Andy drugged up, and boy, I wish like a Joe Rogan or somebody, if he hadn't burned all these bridges, would drag him out of there and go, we're getting you in a fucking facility and you're not leaving. You're just going to stay, because these people don't give a shit about you. They're exploiting you for views and money. And she never gave a fuck about him. No, she didn't. She exploited the shit out of Andy Dick. And look, Andy Dick would have been an, an addict regardless. I get that. But she, she got in his way and she didn't help. No, there was plenty of people that surrounded him that made things probably substantially worse. Substantially you would worse. Think. So here's uh, her and Elisa Jordana fighting over Chicken Andy. Now, again, we've seen all these people. It's fucking humiliating. But uh, even though Andy is probably pilled up and, and drunk right now, he still can see through to the soul of a character. Here we go. Did you just hack me? I just bought a shirt. Oh, fuck? really? With what money, you fucking faggot? Oh, jeez. No. Oh, holy oh. shit. No, you don't. What? I'm wearing the same sweats for three weeks. I was going to buy Out of all the people in this RV, he's the only one I want to see someone try to get him the fuck out of Just there. Just drag him out of the pits of hell and help him yeah. somehow. Yeah. What's it? Can you? Oh, what? Really? Oh, what? Show me. You Take were? Yeah, can you can you can shut me the oh, Calm down. down. No, I'm not calm. Why? No. Why? Settle down. What? Are you going to get me my fucking bird, you faggot? Want to get a bird? Jeez, oh, all right. Yeah. No, no, no. Let's yes. get a bird. Let's go to Petco. It's, on. it's right down the street. Yeah. Let's go. How much is a bird? You know what? Sucks you told me you did. Well, I didn't. You did. I don't think she does. I wouldn't even do it. Yeah. And there's no point you to suck that. His dick, For what right? reason? You suck, you suck his, his dick. You suck his dick. I don't know. I don't think she's like that. I really don't. You were with him all day. No, I wasn't. It doesn't mean anything. And also, it's not true. You guys were with him. If you're a good person, <laughs> if you're a good person, because she's not drunk, she's not on drugs no. in any of this. If you're a good person, and you're about positivity. You don't go into this RV and play with these people. I actually was just finding myself sitting here thinking, why would you want to be in this vehicle at all with anyone? Like, any of you should not want to be around the other one. The only reason you should be in that vehicle is you're trying to take somebody home. You're trying to get them the fuck out of there. 
Because this is the most exploitative shit I can think of. Where is Andy Dick's family, by the way? Does he have any? I, Nobody uh, cares? He's get, you know, the pro the worst part is he got kids. Oh, he has kids, and too. And that fucking sucks, man. But, like, she's in there sober to manipulate these fucking people for entertainment and for donations and for clout. The, everything we've given her, she deserves this and whatever punishment awaits her in hell. Because this is just a bad thing to do. To sit in this RV full of drugs and booze and addicts and to sit there and just, I'm just making content. Well, this is evil. And if she says she cares about Andy so much, like you've got Andy completely, like you said, probably drugged up and drunk and all this shit. And he's sitting there saying, I've been in the same sweats for three weeks. And like, you're not going to try to get that person help. How are you, you not about hustling them? him into your car right now and saying, we're leaving here and we're never coming back? You know why? Because yes. that community would turn on her and they'd burn her down and she's terrified. She has nothing to talk about at that point if right. she gets somebody help. God, she's just, I got a sense of humor with all the lol cows. I don't have a sense of humor with this one because this one is evil. my problem with people like people like this. I don't even have a problem with evil. I have a problem with evil masquerading as something else. Chad Zumach doesn't rage and then go, I'm a really calm, decent human being. He doesn't do no. that. He goes, fuck these people. I fucking hate them. They're fucking scumbags. They fucking suck. She makes me like Chad Zumach. Because I go, at least Chad is Chad and he's mm -hmm. being authentic, okay? He's lying about people. He's not telling the truth about people, but it's self-preservation lies. Mm -hmm. He's being himself. This chick has like many faces. She's the many-faced. She's the many-faced wench. Uh, wench, yeah. None of them are the real one though. I don't think she knows which you, one's the real one anymore. Nope, you lose track. No. One more gay F word out of Andy, by the way, and we're gonna tap out of this one. No. Do you wanna think about the I was with one? my fucking Bitches that protect me. No, right dude, right. that's your fiance. Watch it. Yeah, be nice. Thank you, Sunflower, for the um, do you wanna get Yeah, be nice to me, Andy, while you sit there and exploit him for clout and for donations and, and, and text to speech. And listen to her hype men behind the uh, camera, too. Like, oh, that's your fiance. They're You'd all egging nice him on. They're egging a drunk drug addict on. For content. Dude, I couldn't care to talk to a drunk person like usually. There's no reasoning right. with them. Do you want to get some, like, you should get some meat, like, some I'm upset about a lot of things. Like, careful. Careful. Let's go to Rayo. Let's go somewhere good. Come on. Let's go somewhere good. Let's relax for a minute. No, right. he should go to rehab. He should go to a facility. He shouldn't be going. You don't bring that to a restaurant or a store. If you gave a flying fuck about him. That's true. You would take him somewhere. Yeah, you don't suggest to bring this in public. I would never bring you in public like this. And I bet you if she takes him somewhere, she doesn't turn the fucking phone off. No. She doesn't kill the video feed. She needs to have it on there for some content and like just in case he gets angry and hostile I, with her. I cannot stop until the entire internet knows that she's trash. Until they see what I'm saying. Now, don't get me wrong. I've been getting lots of messages from people who are terrified to speak publicly. Mm -hmm. Who say... I've been exposed by her before and I've been treated this way by her discord before. And, I, and I'm and i like, look, you don't need to go public with any of this stuff. I'll share your stories, so on and so forth. But I'm on a crusade here. I am on a crusade, not to, not to ruin her. I just want her, I want people to see what she is because I think then the rest will take care of itself. Put the spotlight on her. Yeah. All right, you're okay. Don't be so mean. You're sad. Just cry. Cry it out, babe. Not at all. I think we should get you some, like, some steak. Yeah. Another drug let's, addict. Alisa hey. is sitting in a, in a vehicle full of drug addicts enabling all this hey shit. Hey, guys, let's go spend Andy's money somewhere. That's a good point. Yeah, let's go spend the money that these donations well, are coming in for for Andy on feeding this drunk drug addict who needs to be... If you spent that money on... Re, if you were doing this to raise money for a rehab stint... I'd still think you're scum, but at least you're doing something nice with it. So earlier in this video, she starts with, oh, let's go get a burger. Andy, let's go get a burger. You know, put some food in his stomach. But then yeah. she says, let's go somewhere nice. Guys, let's go somewhere nice. And, and that's all I can think of is spend, spend, spend. Let's spend his money. And again, she'll keep the camera on. Yeah. Want to go to Lala's? That would be appropriate. Let's go to Lala's. Shit. Out of them. Both of them. I'll take them. See, everybody loves you. I'll take them over. So many places around here. Why are you so anxious, Randy? Because he just woke up, I think, right? Did he just wake up? No! He's on drugs and he's drunk! 
Look at her trying to excuse it away, though. He just she knows up. better. That's like, I don't know. Yeah, it's it's beyond. Anything if somebody were before. doing this to a friend of mine, I would be in that RV. If I saw this on the internet, I'd be beating the shit out of people to get him out of there. Yes. If that were a You're friend, you're not. Of mine. You don't care about somebody if you leave them like this. Wow, is that? I gotta go. Let's go to the chat so I can uh, try to be funny again. And because uh, I just get mad, <laughs> you lost I get it. mad yeah. with this chick. I really get mad with well, her. Well, she is. The mood with six bucks says. After some research, I think I found out she was born in eighty four. That it's not what I'm seeing. I'm seeing that, that she her... was. I've seen nineteen seventy nine. I've seen eighty four. Look, the fact that there's at least three different years I've seen her born in shows me she's ashamed of her age and, and lies about it. Yes, nobody can keep up. Oh. Uh, uh, Tommy, uh, Tubby says for a trailer park trash podcast, El Eliza, Elisa will be hot looking. Yeah, that's true. Got a grade on a curve. Yeah. Uh, David Chandler says, I don't know how much Elisa I can handle in one day, though. She fills me with rage. Yeah, me too. That's kind of how I feel. I don't like covering her, but I do understand the fact that people need to see what she is. Yeah, because she's she's personally like enabling people to like harm other people's lives right i now. told i told lossless and i told mersh and i told others if you ever want to work together on anything like documentary wise about this i'm i'm in i wrote turkey tom and told him the same thing uh <laughs> the dusty roads i understand i understand baby uh i'll take andy in the death pool yeah <laughs> dusty writes omaha if you will <laughs> Why do I podcast says call into my show today? I wish I could, but we we're so behind on so many things because we've been doing so many shows and stuff that uh, we do have to get out and, you know, do some stuff today. Oh, that must have been what he meant. Like steel toe overtime on his Remember You said that a little bit ago. Oh he, yeah. Go, how no, we did go, Chrissy's yesterday. Yeah, Go watch him and do all that stuff. And yeah, well, the Chrissy thing went longer than we thought it would. We streamed for six hours yeah. yesterday. More heartless and soulless. Elisa Jordana or Kalila Kuhn. Uh, Elisa. 100%. I'd say Elisa too. I think Kalila would help Bobby if he was in that kind of shape. Or she'd leave. She'd leave or she'd help. She wouldn't broadcast it. That's a tough one for me. Actually. I don't think Kal Now that the longer I'm sitting here thinking about it, I do think she's a fucking conniving. So do I. Scheming piece of shit. But I think if Bobby were <laughs> fucked up in an RV, she would have been gone a long time ago. She either, wouldn't be either there gone filming Either gone or she does need to help Bobby enough so that he's still existing for her to be around. Maybe. Uh, David writes, Elisa, be nice, Andy. I'm innocently exploiting your addiction. Right. Uh, she always puts herself in a position to act like she is, like, you know, when she says things like, oh, it's okay, baby. Cry it out, baby. Um, yeah. she, she's always trying enabler. to make sure that like the optics look like they're in her favor. Like she's the kind yeah. person. Brian says, I agree with you, Aaron, but Andy Dick doesn't deserve any help. I hear you. I hear you, but he doesn't deserve to be played with like this. Nobody does. Nobody in that situation deserves to be played with. I they deserve to be left alone. I wouldn't wish, or wish, <laughs> I wouldn't wish this on my worst enemy. Yeah, I really wouldn't. Like Andy deserves to be in that RV and all of that stuff, but he doesn't deserve to have people play with him and no. film him and exploit him. Do you like know that. why? Because that doesn't make you any better. Right. 